When it comes to custom store listings, we mostly had announcements that were expected, but still very good to receive confirmation that Google is about to release custom store listing for inactive users, which will be great to re-engage past users or inactive users of your app with assets that focus on new features. Another one is custom store listing for Google ads. This one has been highly anticipated. It's meant to roll out very soon, according to Google. One important note on that one is that it will only be available for YouTube and AdMob, which means that for now there won't be any custom store listings in Google Play Search or Explore. For custom store listings is an option to now bulk edit custom store listings with custom store listing groups, which really shows how Google wants to facilitate the use of custom store listings for all app developers. The last announcement was the release of custom store listing groups. This one is actually already live in your console and it will allow all developers to make bulk edits to any custom store listing or easily duplicate an existing store listing for creating new ones.